WTFNN. Headline news update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman on this Friday, the last day of the week, and just before the long weekend, Labor Day weekend, have a wonderful long weekend. Well, let's look at the Dow. This is the 10 a.m. Tiger Financial Net News Network update, and we're looking at the Dow down 147 at 35,295 for subscribers to my opening call. I've been showing this particular pattern, the oval pattern. Is it going to arch over and break to below 35,150 uh, in the next couple of days? Which would be quite negative. Or is it going to break to the upside, get to the 35,600? Well, this is kind of a test right here. We're down 147 to 35,295, stalling in within the range, but stalling. Look at the S&P made an all-time high. And I do call this a leg C, maybe a peak C today with one little pop-up perhaps next week. And then I think we start to ch chop, chop, chop with slightly lower highs and lower lows. That's the thinking right now. In the meantime, back at the ranch, uh, down 8 at 45.28. Uh, we'll see what happens by the end of the day. Day is young. Look at the leg D in the weekly chart. Look at the wonderful leg B in the monthly chart. We're looking at the QQQ. Also taking a little bit of a breather uh, yesterday, but today it's coming back, although it's um, below yesterday's high. And the all-time high of 382.71, it's a 381.38. It's just an eye blink away from making that uh, leg D in the uh, daily chart. We'll see if it's able to do that leg E in the weekly, leg G stash C in the monthly. And we've got IWM. This is going to be the one that really tells a lot about what's happening in the rotational aspect of the market. It's down 92 at 228.05, the iShares Russell 2000. Can it get to 232 by next week or will it start to slide under 225? We're looking at gold because of the, um, uh, the, the jobs number. Gold is up, it's up 14 at 1826. Leg D underneath the previous highs. We're going to be watching this good action. I've been saying all the time, gold is okay. And the gold stocks are really not following. You're looking at uh, crude oil right here. Crude oil is trading uh, down just a little bit, holding in that uh, 69 area. Next week, we're going to have to watch the 71 and a half uh, upside, or is it going to break the uh, 67 support? Uh, TLT, we'll have to talk about as soon as we return because the TL down, TLT is down sharply, so yields up. This is an important moment. There's a lot to talk about. I'll be back for my Tiger Technicians Hour in a few minutes and check out my opening call. A daily newsletter. We've had some really nice trades there. I'll be 